Hello, people. This is uh, Mike June II, <clears throat> and this is Let's Play Fallout 3 Evil Karma Edition. Now then, uh, in the last video, we actually took on a fucking spaceship, and we won. We kicked ass, and all the good stuff. Now then, I just want to show that I am actually going to be playing on hard now, because it was too easy in Zeta. It, it really was. Very hard too hard. Normal is too easy, so we're going to stick with hard. So there we go. Hopefully that works out. I'll stick with hard for the rest of the game. So there you go. Uh, so yeah, sorry for lying and all that good stuff. But anyway, that's besides the point. Now we're going to be taking on the pit. With the pit, you actually want to listen to this, uh, distress signal. This message repeats. To anyone who can hear me, my name is Werner. I come from a settlement to the north. I have information of great value to anyone willing to help me free my people. Please, help us. This message repeats. No, 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 no. Who can hear me. Not listening to that forever. Which doesn't matter, because I need to turn off the radio anyway. So, you can't... I, I find that stupid. I, I understand that's a radio signal, but they really should make it so it doesn't matter because it's not going to play any music unless they want it to play it, play music or something. I don't know. Anyway, that's besides the point. Uh, don't want to push quit. Now, funny enough, you won't find a marker on your map like some, like some of the things do, but you actually have to go to the quest and select Into the Pit. Find the source radio transmission. And if you don't know this, this is the pit, which is the add-on we are doing for Fallout 3. This is going to be the last one that doesn't involve the main quest, and it's all the way up there. And luckily, we can go to the power station for a quick transport. Whee! And you can't bring any companions with you, like usual, which sucks. Ooh, we're almost at level 30. Wow. That was lovely. Thanks. Nope. Oh yeah, by the way, I got bored. I don't think I ever came back here to take the nukes at all. But I'm keeping the alien blaster and the captain uh, sidearm with me. Captain sidearm is pretty much the same looking weapon, just it uses the other thing and it's less powerful. Oh, and it's kind of like a scatter shot. Forgot about that. I'm going to take it with me for this just for fun. It won't be binded. It'll just be like, oh, I'm bored. Let's do something different, guys. And hi -ya! Sweet and all that good stuff. I have to say, I really like how Fallout 3 is running. I don't know what it is. Lag here and there, but nothing too, too bad in my opinion. Uh, maybe it's because I decided to get Catalyst. Well, I downloaded Catalyst for my AMD uh, video driver, so maybe that's helping a bit, I'm not sure. So, yeah. This can be a pain in the ass if you don't have that marker location. I believe that's a close... God, Fallout 3 is lagging. Shit. That's really annoying. I usually have trouble getting to this guy, so if I have to have trouble climbing over this cliff, I'm just going to TLC my way over it. <laughs> just to be honest, because it's just, it's just going to get annoying. If I, Because you guys don't want to sit me here going, how the fuck do I get up there? Okay, there's no fucking way I can get around there, okay? I just, I just can't do fucking shit, you know? I just don't want to get pissed off. And my throat is fucking up. I wanted to record this earlier today, but my cousin decided to come over, which just made me go, fuck. Because now when I record, it's going to be like, hey, what you doing? What are you doing? Why are you talking to yourself? And I'm just going to be like, go the fuck away. I don't give a shit. So, yeah. Physics! God, this is really going to be a pain in the ass, isn't it? If this doesn't help me get up there, then I'm just TLCing my way over there. I don't give a shit. Plus, the fucking lag is pissing me off. And there's not much I can do, but, eh. Oh, great. Radiation. How lovely. I do believe you can find the doctor guy around here for whatever reason. Yep, yeah, it's becoming a pain in the ass. And now the flame comments resume. I actually never got a flame comment about the DLC stuff, but, uh, whatever. It's not like I'm... I'm just speeding it up. That's all I'm really doing. Yay, console commands. Where would the PC community be without you? I bet that's only people who complain to you like, Ugh, console commands are stupid. Be all like, what? Why? Because you can't use them because you're on a console? No! And by the way, I do believe consoles and PCs can live within each other. In harmony and in peace. And fuck, I have to go over there. I better not miss this jump. Yeah, No! Take that. <laughs> I wonder what's underground, out of your curiosity. By God! Weird contraptions everywhere! There's actually some hidden stuff in Fallout 3 if you look, if you fuck with the TLC in certain areas. You just find the weirdest shit. 
Oh, no, I can't go in this direction. All right, then. How far am I away? Not that far. Sweet. So, what should we keep with us? Why not? Oh, by the way. That's how fast that thing fires. Did you see how slow it fired in Zeta? God, that, that pissed me off. I think that's the broadcasting station we're supposed to go to. Hey, there's a few people up here. Nice. I guess Warner wasn't the only one. Holy shit! Hit Raider? Die, you piece of shit. Come on. I can't have this guy die. Thank you for your help with those guys. They finally tracked me down. I thought I'd have more time. You've come about the broadcast, right? Risky, I know. But it had to be done. So you know who I am. Who are you? I'm a better fighter than you. That's who. Can't handle <laughs> can't handle a couple raiders. Yeah, whatever. I didn't come to DC to swap insults with wasters. You want to flap gums fine, but don't waste my time. Now, whatever. You came about the broadcast. You want to hear what I have to say about the pit or not? What? It's not my fault you can't shoot straight. You're a real joker, aren't you? Yep. Whatever. Shut up and listen. I come from a place called the pit. It's a city far to the northwest. The place is a nightmare for, well, for so many reasons. But the problem I have right now is that my people are slaves. Wow, well, sucks no for deal, you. right? But I have the chance to free them. I just need an outsider's help before that chance is gone. Yeah, if people need you, are you? What are you doing I'm on here? I'm run from our dead friends over there. As soon as I found out about the cure, they came after me. And you can be damn sure they won't be the only ones. Yeah, cure a cure. You're sick. Ah, get away. Yeah, what's a cure about? The pit is a mess. Nearly everyone who lives there is either sick, dying, or worse. It's the water and the air. You can't escape it. You stay there a few years, and no matter what, it'll get to you. But the bastards who have my people, they found a way to cure it. Wow. And once they have the cure perfected, we stand no chance. So we get the cure. With it, we turn the tables on them. Wow. What's your goal? The city is controlled by a man <clears throat> named Asher. He's Asher. Powerful. No one there dares go against him. No one except me. <laughs> I need you to sneak into the pit and find a way to get close enough to him to steal the cure. Nothing to it, right? Pretty much. I guess so. What am I trying to get? It's the key to a cure for the mutations. Everyone in the pit is mutated in some way. Some are just sick. Some are worse. Ouch. The bosses have the key to the cure. With it, we can take control of the city and free my people. Alright then, so what do you need to do first? Well, you might try a disguise. They probably won't let some random armed waster pass the gates. Ah! But if you look like one of the working stiffs, you should be able to slip in with no problem. Lucky for us, a group of slavers is nearby waiting to make a sale. You should be able to get one off of them. They're off Ugh. to the west, near the tunnel that leads to the pit. That should be our first move. All right, fine. I'll find my way uh, in. Well, that's not the best idea, but at this point I'm pretty much out of options. So if that's how it has to be. Huh, all right then. We don't exactly have to carry a slave outfit? Huh, never tried this part. I really do love the pit. It is the most diverse out of all the DCs in my, uh, DLCs in my opinion, DCs. It is the most, I believe it's the most diverse out of all the DLCs in my opinion. Like... When I think of a good game that does karma, a good karma and bad karma uh, kind of thing, is when you really, like, is, as much as it seems like it should be obvious, I like the ones that make it make you think to yourself going, I don't know if that's really bad or good or not. And while most of it's pretty easy, it just, there are points in this that really come to that point. Infamous 2 is a huge example of that, where really, I sometimes I can't even feel the, the bad ending is necessarily bad, but whatever. Alright then, I don't know, I don't want to fuck up, so let's see if this works. Oh, wrong person. Hey. There's slavers, oh, hey, look, they have a dog. Aww, and it's just like dog meat, what a fucking surprise. 
Seriously, why do they get so lazy with the animation, with the dog thing? Couldn't they just, like, fucking... I don't know, they could... Oh, god damn it. God fucking damn it. An albino red scorpion, that's what I fucking need. That should help. Oh. That thing barely gets fucking hurt, of course. I think we've seen... Have we seen an albino red scorpion? I think we have, anyway. Let's die, you piece of shit. Thank you. Oh god, I kind of fell. Stay down! Sit the fuck down! I said sit! <laughs> Critical hit every time. That ain't this fun. Uh... Help a bit. Got it. I've been, I've been watching too many sandbox games, so I'm thinking of the idea of blowing up cars to kill somebody else. Funny enough. You piece of shit. Where the fuck you going? Where the fuck you going? Gotcha. Ha. Piece of shit. All right then. Her her her. It's a 69. That's a buttload of EXP before we go into the pit. Nice. Remember, albino red scorpions give off huge amounts. Because they're tough as shit, man. It's really the only monster that really helps with the insect perk. The perk that does more damage to the insects. It's the only one that's actually fucking useful. When I say useful, it's fucking useful. Alright, another quick save. We'll do it again just to be safe. Fuck off. Wow. You're a nice guy. Hey, that's the that's uh Sidley, because I just got I'm I'm actually uploading the last episode of Operation Operation Anchorage right now. That's a silly voice. Unless you're looking to take a vacation from your freedom, you'll get the fuck out of my face. I'll fuck your face in a second if you don't shut the fuck up. What are you point well, God, you're like a fucking vampire from Oblivion. Unless you're looking to take a vacation from your freedom, you'll get the fuck out of my face. Wow, you guys are assholes. Uh All right, slaver. You're not the guy we're waiting for, so we. What the fuck are we supposed to do? Hey. Oh, here we the go. Guy from the pit. Yeah, it's me. I'm here to buy the slaves. About damn time you showed up. We've been waiting here for. Whatever, man. You're here now. We got three. Usual price, two hundred each. Finally, here's the key. To oh God damn it! I pushed the wrong one. Whatever you want with it. Oh hey, Eulogy says to tell your man that we're sorry that we could only get three. We'll get a better pleasure. To God damn it! I did not mean to do that. Do you actually have it at all? He has it. Huh. Well, whatever. I honestly don't care. Oh my god! Are you real? I don't care where you go. I'm not taking you anywhere, you're free to go. Thank you. Well, what's the deal? Please. Wait, you're supposed to do something else. God damn it. See if this works. Usually you do something where you talk to one of the guys. I don't know, maybe you have to kill everybody first. <laughs> they get in the fuck out of here. One slave outfit. And now he has more clothes on. This is weird because you're usually supposed to... I think you have to kill everybody here. But it's kind of odd. It's like, it's all like, um... I honestly don't know what's going on, so I just enter the pit. This isn't. This is gonna be the harder way to do this shit if I have to. Um, stats. Not stats. Where's the quest? Quests. Just travel to the pit. 
It's not how you do it unless Warner Travis here real fast. Oh yeah, you're already here. Fuck. Ready. Just jump on the cart. And decide to freeze. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Stupid thing. You're ready. Just jump on the cart. No problem. It'll be a long trip. Let's get going. I think at this point, he usually makes comments about your companions with you. Like, oh, you're going to have to leave your mutt behind, or you're going to leave that monster behind for, like, Fox or something. So, yeah, you cannot, can't bring anybody else, and I guess that's it, huh? So, whatever. But, yeah, there's something out there I was going to talk about where apparently it's like, I think you have to kill all the slavers. I thought that was supposed to be, like, the evil way or something, but I don't know. I've never really done this before. But you kill all the slavers, and then, um, yeah, after you kill them... Uh, the guy would be like, oh my god, am I free to go? He's like, yeah, I need a suit for the for the uh, pit or something. And then he's like, oh, you, the guy over there is dead. And you're supposed to be like, oh, I don't want to take a dead one. Give me yours. And he's like, what? It's all what I will have. And then you have to you kill him it. or something. Are you about ready to go? Yeah, so let's get the fuck out of here. Let's quick save real fast. Travel to the pit. The tunnel leads to a complicated network of tunnels and highways. So travel far to the northwest, to the pit. The going will be rough and harsh. Supplies will be scarce and you won't be able to run until your business there is concluded. Are you sure you want to travel to the pit? Travel to the pit! Whee! So then! Got like this little montage thing like with, um, um... Fuck, I already forgot the other name of the other one. Oh, I thought we had a little montage thing. What the f Never mind, fuck. Hang on, someone's coming. Let me do the talking. It's okay. You don't have to do the what the hell. When when were we allowed to climb in Fallout 3? This is stupid. I want to climb. Never. I guess I can use this. Hey hey, what are you guys doing here? I might ask you the same thing. You've got a lot of guts coming back to this place, well. Yeah. Well, I guess that's the difference between us. I have a lot of guts. You don't. Holy shit! Okay, you're not bad with the shot after all. Holy shit, you damn. Damn, son. Watch out. Where? You killed them all. What the fuck are you firing at? Oh, there they are. Just die, you piece of shit. God, you suck even in hard mode. Yeah, Warner does that. He. It's dead. Can we go now? He does that. He just gets fucked up. We've got to keep moving. There's no time. Oh yeah, we have to keep moving. Of course, the guy who's firing at the floor for fucking nothing, moron. But yeah, I kind of like Warner. He kind of is cool, but he's like, even though he's trying to be the hero of his people, he's still kind of an ass in a sense. Which, hey, I can respect that. Unless he's an ass to me. Asshole. Alright, then, I'm just gonna go in there, guns blazing. With the suit on, because I can just hide all my gear and whatnot. And he walks as slow as a motherfucker, I'll tell you that much. I got a text. We can wait for him to walk. No. Damn it, phone. Stupid phone. Sorry, I had a text message from my girlfriend, like usual, and he stops. It's like, you can't just wait. Oh, I'm gonna stop because you stopped. Oh, yeah, guy who goes as slow as. Just fucking run. Alright, let's go. This is as far as I can go. It's up to you from here on out. Oh, thanks. Don't expect to take anything you have in with you. They'll strip you clean, but I'll find a way to get your things back to you. Oh, thanks. Once you're inside, find a slave named Adia. She'll be able to help you. Remember, your goal is to get access to Asher and find the cure. After you have it, I'll contact you. All right, I guess. Yeah, but I don't think I trust it's you. It's a bit too late for that now, isn't it? Either way. Oh, lovely. Thanks.